yet another new ransomware family appeared in the wild. This one is called HLocker. The interesting part about this new ransomware is that it's misusing a legitimate command line tool to encrypt the files. And this is of course not the first time we've seen criminals misuse legitimate tools. In the past we've seen ransomware utilizing clean tools such as WinRAR with a very long password to encrypt files. This time it's the encryption tool called H, which is an acronym for actually good encryption and it's a free tool which was developed by Google engineer and is available on the internet. The command line tool uses an elliptic curve encryption algorithm, making it impossible to brute force the decryption with current methods. Instead of leaving a ransomware note on the system, the recent uh, victims received a ransom note by email asking for about 65,000 US dollars. The attackers also offer five files decrypted for free, just in order to prove that they still have the key. And again, I probably should highlight it's not the fault of the developer, but rather shows that criminals are always trying to find new ways of hiding their activity behind benign, clean tools. This dual-use strategy is quite common at the moment with attackers. Acronis CyberProtect utilizes advanced behavioral analysis to watch processes and can keep ransomware from infecting endpoints before the encryption can damage file, regardless of the tools or encryption algorithms being used. And even if some files would get impacted, they can be restored instantly from the backups.